Joanne Butler, who is of mixed New Ireland, East New Britain and New Zealand parentage, recently debuted for the National Women's Rugby Union team PNG Palais when she made the sevens team to the World Cup Sevens Challenge Series in Chile back in August this year. Upon the team's return, Joanne did not rest on her laurels but continued to work hard at training to better her game. All her hard work, sacrifice and perseverance paid off again when she won her sport back in the Palais current squad for the upcoming Oceania Sevens Rugby Tournament in Brisbane this weekend. Joanne said she's really excited and looking forward to embrace the opportunity and make her family and the country proud. First, she reflects back on her early rugby journey playing 15. Back in um, 2017, yeah, so it all started from there and um, I got a um, call out um, to start with 15s at first and we travelled out to Fiji. Um, yeah, I had my first 15s games there. How was, how was that? Oh, it was tough. It was tough. We went against like Fiji, Samoa, and um, uh, New Zealand. Man, that was like one of the <laughs> toughest games that we had to go against. Uh, toughest teams that we had to go up against. After the 15th tour to Fiji, Joanne was brought straight into the sevens team that toured Sydney for a trial match against Australia in 2019. She said transcending to sevens rugby was fast and entertaining compared to the 15th game, which is really enjoying at the moment. Uh, sevens is a uh, fast, um, entertaining. Uh, it's fun. It's fun. You just uh, the game's just competitive and. It, you just enjoy it. I think the preparation we had was um, was short, and um, mentally we we could have done better. So preparing, coming back and preparing ourselves has been um, has been a big improvement. Focusing on this weekend's Oceania Sevens Challenge, Joanne said this time around the girls had more preparation time and more focused than the Chile Challenger series. Jerry Longwood. TV One Sports. Thanks for watching TV One News. Please like and subscribe, and don't forget to hit the notification bell to stay up to date with the latest news.